My name is Mark Rubin and I'm a senior neurology resident at the Mayo Clinic and I wanted to talk to you all today about a recent publication in postgraduate medicine uh, that I published along with my colleagues uh, Kay Wellick who's a health science librarian, Dwight Channer who's the operations manager for the Mayo Clinic Arizona Telestroke program and Dr. Bart DeMarshall who is the medical director for the Mayo Clinic Arizona Telestroke program. This study is called Systematic Review of Telestroke. The basic question we seek to answer is where is the field currently and where can we take it so as to better serve our patients? This particular study uh, was focused on telestroke and uh, what we did was a systematic review of all publications since uh, 1996 up through the third week of July 2012. Uh, we chose this time range because the term telestroke wasn't even mentioned in the literature until February of 1999 when it was first published in the journal Stroke by Drs. Levine and Gorman. Uh, after uh, searching through the uh, many hits, 1,405, uh, we found only 145 unique articles uh, to scrutinize and see where stroke is at this point. Uh, of note, there were uh, 74 uh, narrative reviews and uh, only around 70 papers that were actually considered primary data. One of the uh, more striking findings of this study is that uh, there's a relative paucity of uh, randomized controlled trials and cost-benefit analyses which uh, on its face seems like would be the uh, reasonable sorts of papers needed to uh, justify use in the field. However, because we are able to identify that there is a, a relative shortage of uh, such high level of evidence, we hope that this review can serve as scaffolding for uh, directing future research within the field. More specifically, we think that uh, more study directed toward cost analysis, and improvement in outcomes should be the major focus of telestroke studies going forward. If you'd like more information on telestroke practice, either more generically or by the Mayo Clinic in particular, please visit the link below uh, for more information.